extending to that practice, huh? Knocking down a couple of passes. Oh yeah, just trying to get better and make plays for the team. How are you feeling so far from the first week of uh, training camp? I'm feeling good. I feel like uh, our team is getting better each and every day, and um, we're just competing every compete, competing really hard, and um, we making each other better. Just the defense come come along from the first day of camp to where they are right now as far as the, the cohesiveness and the, and the fluidity of the defense. Uh, everybody's running to the ball. Everybody's um, buying into uh, our culture that we're trying to bring to the uh, team, and um, everybody just loves being around each other. What was the um, what was the message from the coaches heading into this training camp in terms of your role and sort of how you're going to carve that out in terms of playing inside, outside? What was what was sort of the message from the coaches then? Uh, they just want me to learn, uh, learn both of the uh, positions because you never know how the season goes. And uh, whatever the coaches want me to play at, that's what I'm going to play at. And um, it's a team game, so whatever that helps the team, that's what I want to do. What are the challenges of playing inside versus playing outside? Uh, I mean, it's kind of the same. It's just different techniques and um, just learning different. Um, the calls are kind of different inside, so you have to just adjust to the calls get the sense that, that that might be you know your best opportunity in terms of getting on the field you know with JC back in practice and, and Mike also outside do you get the sense that you know your, your most of your snaps might end up coming in there in uh time? well I just can uh, train to, to for outside and inside whatever the coach wants me to play at that's what I'm gonna play at and um I'm behind all my guys and I want all my guys to do good so you know whatever makes the team better Mike, who can go up and get passes. Keenan, who's more of the route runner. Well, how, how does that help you see the different type of receivers that you guys have to face during uh, training camp? Oh, we have uh, uh, we have a lot of great receivers on our team, um, and each of them have their own specific traits that they have. So you know, going against them in practice, it helps you kind of defend every receiver in the NFL because you get to go against whatever you need. What do you think is the, the biggest key for you guys becoming? a consistent unit, more consistent than you've been the last couple of seasons? Uh, just doing all the little things right um, uh, and just staying together throughout the season. You know, it's a long season uh, and just staying healthy. Your rookies on the defensive end. Oh, they're doing great. We have a lot of great uh, corners, linebackers, uh, D-line. We have a lot of great rookies and uh, I'm excited to see them play in preseason and uh, show their talents and um, I just can't wait to see them ball. They've been working hard every day, and uh, I'm just glad that their, their dream is coming true. You mentioned the culture and cohesion for the defense, but for that secondary group in specific, is, does it feel the same way just because it's another year of like running back the same core? Like you guys are more familiar with each other? Uh, yeah, definitely. Uh, we definitely familiar with each other, and uh, it's kind of like a brotherhood, and we set in the culture here, and um, everybody just want to see everybody do good, and um, you know. Just come out here and when you're working with somebody and a lot of people every day you kind of build chemistry with them along the way so you know it's going to be ups and downs but we at the end of the day we all wear chargers and uh, chargers gear so that's what we do it for the chargers